Another black eye for the Bahamas that smashed a dock in Jamaica and strong numbers in the Caribbean. Cruise News Today starts now. From the Cruise Radio Studio in Jacksonville, Florida, this is Cruise News Today with Doug Parker. Good morning. Here's your cruise news for Monday, February 12th. Two women from Kentucky are speaking out after their drinks were spiked and then assaulted by staff members at Pirates Cove Beach Resort in Freeport, Bahamas. Now, the pair were on a four-night carnival cruise when the ship docked in Freeport on the very last day of their trip, and they went to the beach. After accepting a two-for-one drink offer from a resort staff member, they soon fell ill and then lost consciousness. They later discovered they had been assaulted, showing physical signs of the attack and testing positive for narcotics. Bahamian police arrested two men in connection with the assault following an investigation that included reviewing security footage and interviewing staff members. The FBI has also stepped into this investigation. Multiple parties say there is more to this story because the timelines, the testimony, and the closed-circuit TV footage do not align. The girls are now back home in Kentucky. And the cruise pier in Ocho Rios that was smashed last week by Carnival Magic is out of service for a little while. Citing pier repairs, Carnival has informed guests booked on upcoming Western Caribbean sailings on Carnival Horizon that the ship will no longer stop at Ocho Rios, but instead will dock at Falmouth, Jamaica, which is 38 miles away. The change impacts February 11th, the 25th, and March 10th departures. And in January, the British Virgin Islands experienced a remarkable surge in cruise tourism, welcoming 143,780 passengers compared to just 96,600 in January of 23. And cruise line stocks were down on Friday. Carnival Corporation down 2.4%, 15.31. Royal Caribbean down 3.3%, 116.97. And Norwegian down 6.1%, 16.42. If you have a story, drop us a line. Tips at cruiseradio.net. Have yourself a great Monday. I'm Doug Parker with Cruise News Today.